Hello everyone, Cesare here with more Dragon Quest VI. Unfortunately, yesterday we had some internet issues in that it seemed the entire eastern part of Ontario and Montreal, Quebec, and southwestern Ontario all had issues with uh, their internet. Uh, between, well, pretty much right between my uh, stream times. There we go. Okay, so, the stream is now showing. If you recall, we left off here in Somnia. Uh, yesterday we started the game. We did the uh, festival, got the crown after falling through the world into some phantom realm. Now we're trying to join the Somnia military. And to do that, we gotta head south. Oops. To a tower. Did some leveling, uh... So I should be strong enough to do these pretty easily. Alright. Alright. So what do we got here? Welcome to God's Bane Tower! <laughs> Eh, yeah, sorry, just trying to get a set of sinister atmosphere. <laughs> anyway, good luck and Godspeed. Goddess speed. Okay, so you can drop off over there. I love that music. Hardworks! Barksman! Barksman! Ah, That's an amazing name. Stumpkins. Fuck! That yonder chest surely contains the item of which Captain Blade spoke. Alas, I cannot reach it from here. Do they expect me to walk through walls? Probably. There's a fairly decent chance of that. a pretty high encounter rate in this game, unfortunately. And it's largely because of the combat system, which we haven't really gotten into yet. I mean, yeah, we've been fighting things, but they haven't really introduced the locations or anything like that, so... treasure chest just to make sure. In fact, how do you know there's a treasure chest there? It 
Where do you think you're going? The way I see it, you've got two options for getting past me. You either take the long way around, or you can try to move me yourself. What do you say, kid? Fancy a fight? Ha, I like your gumption! Oh god. Alright, let's see if I can beat this guy. Tower Sentry, alright. Alright, Tower's actually got some health. Hey, Pal! I remember you. Great, great to see you again. I remember you from the castle. Do you, do you see that treasure down there? Go on, have a look. No, okay. Oh, hmm. More of these, huh? It's a mind of its own! God's been down, more like Dirty Chuck's Tower. Alright, I think I see where I have to step. I think it's this one. Yep, I'm the best. There we go. Hey, old boy, we've met before! Name's Carver, and yours? That's right, right, right. Yeah, for the trial thing, eh? I don't know who's gonna win this, but if it ain't me, I hope it's you. Good luck and everything like that. Another trial thing, eh? Alright, listen up. Up ahead, you'll find three doors. Open any or all of them. In front of each sits a person. These folks have something to say, so listen closely. Only one of them is actually telling the truth. You gotta use your wits to suss out the liars. Hey, come here often. Hate to break it to you, but there's nothing past this door here. This do the door you want is on the right. That's the winner. Listen up, son. I've seen a lot in my time. These wrinkles come with wisdom. That's why I can say with this, with all honesty, don't go in this door. You'll get yourself hurt, son. The man on the far left is telling the truth. You look like a smart kid. I know you'll believe me. Be careful. All right, let's go in this door. By the goddess, she made it here quick. Yeah, and Blade sure rounded up a clever lot of volunteers for this trial, I'd say. You've conquered the entire fair and square. Please accept your shiny reward. I did it. Now take that back to the castle. Look at he split. That is, of course, if you think that ring is what Captain Blade wants. We'll check the other doors too, just to be sure. Not, I just got a green, uh, gold ring. But that it is though, because it's still on the third floor. Yeah, that's just spikes. Medicinal herbs. I will take it. I'm well to make it this far. It's now time for your final test. If you feel your lack of strength for this last trial, then feel free to turn back and bulk up. You can leave from that ledge to the left to return to the tower's entrance as fast as gravity can take you. So what'll it be? Are you ready for my trial? Yeah, right. Excellent! I'd expect nothing less from a man enlisting in His Majesty's military. Have at you! Another sentry. This is just Garrett. Alright, hi Garrett. 
if I can sap him again. Oh, good, okay. Garrett hits harder than his Power Century compatriot. Trying to assess the situation. The land I'm gonna heal. I'm trying to leg sweep me, that shit. Hmm. I'm writhing on the ground. defeated Garrett. See you later, Garrett. Oof! Nice and done! It was a pleasure losing to you, sir. I was going easy on you, yes, but your fighting skills are more than adequate. Follow me, then. Go on, open up the chest and claim your reward. What luck, the restless heart. That's where he places the restless heart in the bag. He wasn't kidding. We got out of the tower very quickly with that. A hard bark and some ornery onions. See you later. Save too. Yes, there we go. All right. First recruit has returned, Cesare, right? So, what did you bring back for me? Go on, give it up. Yes! The restless heart of Somnia. This charm protects, represents the tireless rather, the devotion of all who protect the kingdom. Outstanding work, recruit! As promised, I hereby grant you all the rights of a Somnian soldier. Let it be known, as of today, Cesare is officially a soldier of the Somnian Royal Military. You're part of an elite group now. Be proud! At ease for now, soldier. Feel free to reacquaint yourself with the castle until you receive further orders. Of course, if you find someone in need, help them. A soldier of Somnia is never truly off duty. Nice work out there, Cesare. You made us proud, Cesare. Now, time to go ransack the castle. King Somnus knows more about the methods of Murdoch's madness than anyone except Murdoch himself. He spent every waking hour studying his opponent. Considering the king never sleeps, that's a lot of studying. Hmm? You saw Murdaugh once in your dreams? Fat lot of good that does us. Who cares what happens in dreamland? The real world is where it counts. Nap less and stay focused on the big battle to come. It won't be long until the final battle with Murdaugh. I can feel it in my bones. If you haven't polished your weapons up, now's the time, brother. I'm still pretty new around here. I joined right after my old man retired. His majesty hasn't said a single word to me yet. <sighs> I wonder if I'll ever get a chance to speak with him. Why does that matter? His majesty is the highest working man in the kingdom. His to-do list is three leagues long. Right now I hear he's recruiting capable soldiers for a search expedition of some sort. 
This stairway leads to the throne room. Do the business with his majesty. Very well, you may pass. But mind your manners in front of the king, you hear? Is what I would have said if you actually had an appointment with him. But you don't, so beat it. Oh, Alright. Kind of an idiot to take me for anyway. Hello, silly. New around these parts, are you? Let me guess. New recruit, don't let us down, soldier. His majesty slaves away all day and night. He's the sire that never sleeps. That means we have to cook twice as many meals. A midnight snack is just another lunch to him. Hey, it's the new recruit. Have you met his majesty yet? No, you better get out there and make a name for yourself. Get his attention. I got a mini medal. Does that count for anything? Welcome to the bars if you want to talk to the prisoners. Dagnabbit! it! I would have gotten away with it if it weren't for that crazy horse. I wasn't gonna hurt that merchant, it's just really the moment girl. That is all, but that beast charged in and wham! God, it was gigantic. That ain't no hard day horse, let me tell ya. No particularly interesting books. The book entitled The Mysterious Metal King. Cesar takes himself and reads the next it. Legend speaks of a king who lavished wonderful prizes on any who helped him collect many metals. Whether or not the, this king still exists is shrouded in mystery. The book entitled The Quotable Slime, Volume 2. Sasha takes it from the shelf and has a closer look. It includes words like... Wise words like, Always surround oneself with goo friends. Offset by Lord Dripping Ooze. There's a book entitled 1001 Jokes for Adventures. Sasha takes it from the shelf and has a closer look. What do you call a robber hiding in a suit of armor? A thief in the night. Sasha sighs and returns the book to the shelf. Are you at all familiar with the Dread Fiend Murder? Mm -hmm. You are? Interesting. Well, what about that so-called Phantom Realm? Mm -hmm. Stumped you on that one, huh? It's another subject of His Majesty's research. I'd say no. The Dread Fiend is no stranger to our nation. He has med meddled him numerous times in the past. Each time King Somnus has driven him back in a costly battle. But whatever we think we have Murdoch garnered, he always appears in a puff of smoke. Disappears in a puff of smoke. Where does this monster come from? And where does he go when he vanishes? Mm -hmm. Such mysteries elude me, but I understand his majesty is close to cracking the case. Oh, our kingdom for a worthy horse. Our kingdom for a worthy horse. This wagon has been in the royal family for generations. But now we can't find a beast to pull it. Not just any old nag will do. Why, the wagon's g guilt alone weighs a ton. Surely there's got to be a decent horse around here somewhere. Have you seen any with a bit of get and go in them? Oh, what a sorry state of affairs. Right, we did actually hear about a horse. Really, Sprendlet? Bring me this beast post haste. We can't let this cart, this splendid cart, rust away in the courtyard. What would neighboring thing and kingdoms think? Nothing. It's a cart. Alright, so we heard word of a, a horse, but who said it? Well, you decided to, to join the royal military. Come to the second amount of glory. Of course, glory is worthless if you die acquiring it. Do be careful. about this, this person before they aren't saying anything new.
What we're looking for is an NPC that talks about getting a mauled by a horse. Wow, you picked the castle, huh? Did you see that notice the wagon in the courtyard? Legend has it that the kings of old rode in that wagon, dashing across the wilderness pulled by mighty steeds. Not just since they're getting dirty. What a shame. It'd be a treat to see it in action again someday. Well, tell me where the giant horse is. Ah yes, the merchants here in town. We're traveling merchants, him and I. At least we were. My partner was mauled by a Mustang in the forest north of the bridge out west. Hopefully we'll be on our way before long. Hello, Wintrig! That's all right, congrats on becoming a soldier. Talk about a dream job. I bet you're gonna go out there and wrangle that Mustang, eh? That ain't no one-man job, Cesar. Believe you and me. How about we team up on this one, eh? Me and horses, we get along, you see. It's settled then. The start of a beautiful relationship and everything like that. You and me are gonna have a blast, Cesar. Howdy, har. Welcome for the host. Stop making vlogs. Well, now he's in our party. Let's go see if we can get him some better gear. Okay, an oaken club would be better. A giant mallet. Carbon sword. Bring, let's just get him the stone axe. It's a bamboo sword. Well, at least he was equipped with something. Scale armor, which I'm going to do. Carver, here you go. Get your scale shield. Anyway, what was your vlog about, or vlog? We'll sell the crap later. Leary loads. We got two party members now, yay! This looks promising. Hard works. Oh shit, Carver's only level 3. HP increases by 7, strength by 2, agility by 1, resilience by 1, wisdom by 1, style by 0. Oh well, he'll be fine. Warning! Wild Mustang spotted nearby! Hey! Cesar, we're just running in circles here. We need a plan. Measure twice, cut once, I always say. Although I don't know why I say it. Alright, let's go, go at it from both sides. I'll go west, you go east. We'll drive her into the dead end up north. Ready? Let's do this. Sorry, girl. Dead end. Might as well give up.
Alright, so are you ready? Count of three, we'll grab it. One, two, three! Nay! Hey. Yeah, got it! You know, for a monster Mustang, she ain't all that feisty. Nay, hey, snort. Look at that, she's rubbing her nose on you, Cesare. Guess she likes us, eh? You better think up of a name for her. Let me ponder a bit. Oh, I know. How about Peggy Sue? A sweet name for a sweet gal. No. Uh, quit your name saying that's the horse's job. Get it? Hurry, <laughs> hurry. That's that. Now, let's get this girl out of here. Cesare and Carver named Peggy Sue. Or tame Peggy Sue. I'm not getting any drop frames today, so my internet seems to be fine. Alright, we got Peggy Sue now. Bring the Mustang into the into the inn with us. Did I know there's a Yokai Watch demo on the 3DS? No, but I'm not particularly interested in demos. I'll check it out though. Oh man, I can still, I think I can download that now. Hello, Bailey Cat. Yeah, I'm intending to continue my adventure. However, I'm gonna reset my recording here. 